Good morning guys. Um, so now I'm walking to my gym, it's Saturday. I didn't do it last week, but we're going for a long run like they did on Saturdays. 14 kilometers, it's gonna be through a beach, up hills, down hills. 10K was last time. So I'm looking forward to this. I love running, I don't know about you, especially running in Thailand is just fucking amazing. It's about 7.30 now. Not that hot actually now. I wouldn't even say it's 20 degrees. I suppose if you're from some countries that's really hot, but when you're here in like 35, 20 seems cool. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna be doing now. Just walking to the gym. Running team, running team, running team, running team, running team, running team. Here we go. Henry Muay Thai, running team, yeah. And now I'm gonna join them. Few of us went, a few of us turned off. Me and her went some long way, up hills, wicked views. Most of the time it's eight kilometers in 10 years. Good shit though. So there were times there that I wanted to give up. Um, Martine at one point went like this, and I thought, what, is that halfway? I can't do this. Really, she was just saying like last kilometer, but I didn't know. But at points I was gonna stop, my body was like, you wanna stop, you need a drink, this and that. My body started stopping, slowing down. But it's your mind is so powerful, because I was like, no. Imagine that I'm doing this run, and if I don't complete this, I don't get the sponsorship. And then all of a sudden, my body got energy, because my mind told it to. So trust me, it's like, if you're in the last round of the fight, you must you must have got that, you might be getting beaten up, and you'd be like, oh no. And some people, you like, give up. Your mind can tell you to, no, be strong, put on, fight back, and you can do it. So, the mind is a powerful thing and anything you do, it can make your body go any way that it wants. So remember the mind, powerful thing. Right, just came to a super cheap, it's called, massive supermarket. Um, loads and loads of stuff, again. Just like another supermarket, or more stuff. You'll see them everywhere as well, like big pink, purple uh, shops, super cheap, 24 hours. And uh, my one, my, my place I stay at in Kangrang Moito just right over there. Yeah, so basically I've got this amino energy. I used to have this when I used to train in the gym and I forgot about how important BCAAs are for your training. It's got a green, ca uh, green coffee bean extract as well. And it really helps your recovery, help, helps your training, helps your recovery. And Martina gave me some, it was fucking lovely, I forgot. So I got some of this in super cheap, which was 7.99 baht. I went to the Villa Market where I've been going and it was 1299, so you gotta shop around. So get your shoes off. Can't even do it. What's going on? And then here we are again. I never come in this entrance. The back entrance. So look, there's the mirrors behind there is the stadium. Office and then yeah. This is the other side. You've got the lines of bags. Sometimes we train here and then this is where we're gonna be sparring. I didn't bring my tripod. I'm not gonna film because there's gonna be, I didn't wanna put it on the ring and it get knocked down, but I could have, thinking about it now, I could have definitely done that because it's not gonna get knocked down. Oh, well, next time, you know, we're gonna spar a lot. So yeah, gonna get sparring in, two hours. Can't wait. There's one guy here already and I thought, oh, it's just me and him at the minute. And I was like, oh no. 
Martina's bike's here, so obviously she's gone for another like 100 kilometer run. <laughs> Every day, twice a day. So a week's training is done. Like four, four sessions, well, eight sessions, or seven sessions in the week. I'm broken. Here's some sparring today. My ankle, the one that was dodging from that, is still playing out, which is frustrating. Because, you know, I just want to get, I just want to be injury free. But anyway, that's what we trained on. Huh? Feel broken. So now, a couple hours and then we're gonna go see uh, Yasmin and, and Jonathan fight in Patong. So that's good. So we're all meeting up at the gym at eight. We're gonna go and we're gonna watch their fight. It's gonna be good. So we're gonna drive. Me and Martina, we're gonna drive to, sorry, she was waving and I just took it off. We're gonna drive for the fight now, see Yasmin and Jonathan, but I think we're waiting for one of the trainers. I don't know if you guys come in, but we're going to drive to the top about 25 minutes and then going to watch him fight. Let's go. Can't see him do that, so. That's how you ride in Thailand. Just get on the back of the truck for you and just go. <laughs> the Tom Boxing Stadium. And there is our team, Jonathan and Yasmin. This is the Boxing Stadium. Got some popcorn there. ที่ไหนที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่ที่